16.3a equations with radicals odd roots. When solving equations we always um, solve by doing the opposite and so when we deal with radicals the opposite of taking a root is to do an exponent or a power. Now if we have the cubic root of x equals 4, then x equals 4 cubed. Now note that this is only works for an odd index. We have some other rules that happens when we have an even index. So in example 1 here, we have the cubic root of 2x minus 5 equal to 6. So in order to solve this, we raise this to the third power. And we, of course, we anything we do on one side of the equation, we do on the other. And so what that means is that when we take the, a cubic root and raise it to the third power, we get just what's inside, which would be the 2x minus 5, equal to 6 cubed, which would be 216. And now we just solve just like a regular equation. So we'll add 5 to both sides. And we get 2x equal to 221 divided by 2. And we'll get that x equals 221 halves. In example 2 we have the fifth root, so we'll raise it to the fifth power. We'll raise it to whatever power the root is, or whatever the index of the root is. So we're going to get 4x minus 7 equal 2 to the fifth power, which is 32. Add 7 to both sides and we get 4x equal to 39 divided by 4 and we'll get that x equals 39 fourths and you're done.